Hey, what's up, y'all? It's in Square Sports coming back with another video. Today, I'm going to be talking about the NFL MVP voting and how that's going, what the odds look like. So, we're going to start uh, the leader in MVP voting right now is Aaron Rodgers, which is kind of surprising. He just overtook um, the other three main guys that are in the running for it. Um, so, I'll give you his stats. Uh, I'll give stats for all the other players as well. Um, he is completing 65.4% of his passes. Pretty good. Um, he has 2300, about 2,300 yards, 2,324 yards, 16 touchdowns, and two picks. He has been sacked 17 times. He has a QBR of 106.7, and his team is 7-1. and one. Now, um, now, he has pretty good stats. Um, and he has a good team as well, and he has a good record. So I understand why he's up there. He has the best record out of any of the MVP um, contestants, I would say. Um, but, you know, his, his stats are good, they're, and they're better than when you, when you look at the quarterbacks. They are better than the rest of the quarterbacks. Everything except for QBR, really, is better. Um, and his record is better, but I just, I don't see it quite yet. I think he's right up there, but I don't know if he's going to end up winning it or not. I just have doubts about him. I could be wrong. Um, he definitely has a case, but right now I just don't see it. Um, but he is, he's plus 250 in the voting. So, I mean, I don't know. I mean, he could end up winning it. I could definitely see it happening, but right now he's not my MVP. Now, who is my MVP and who I would give it to at the moment is Russell Wilson. He's number two in the voting. He's plus 300. He is completing 68.4% of his throws. He has 2,127 yards, 17 touchdowns, and one pick. He's been sacked 19 times, and he has a QBR of 115.5, a lot higher than anybody else in the MVP voting. Uh, his team's 6-2, so he had a pretty rough week last week I'll just say that really not a bad week it's just compared to the rest of the quarterbacks he didn't have a very very good week and his team lost so that kind of hurt um he's six and two though and I think right now he is the MVP I just think his numbers overall are better he has a couple hundred less yards but a better other stat so number three in third place is Deshaun Watson of the Houston Texans, he's plus 600 uh, to win MVP. He has 69.3% completed completion percentage, uh, 2,200 yards, 16 touchdowns, but he has five picks, but he's been sacked 24 times. So that's seven more than Rodgers and five more than Russell Wilson. So the offensive line is not protecting him as well as the other two. And he still is right up there with yards. He's right, he's in second in yards of the MVP. Uh, contestants um, he has a 105.7 QPR which is pretty good not great but pretty good his team is five and three so he's just because of the record of his team and um, the picks that he's thrown you can't I don't think you can give him MVP right now now if he ended up with let's say 35 to 40 touchdowns and six or seven picks for the entire year I think that'll be good enough because I don't see really in a place where Rodgers or Wilson will throw less than five. I think they'll throw at least five, probably closer to six or seven. So I think if Watson could uh, only throw a couple more picks the rest of the year, I think he has a chance to do it. I just don't know. They're, they're with their division with the Colts. I don't really know how their schedule is going to end up. But, you know, it's, po it's a possibility for sure. So the last guy on this list that I'm going to list off is uh, Christian McCaffrey. He's a running back. He's plus 800. Um, I really love Christian McCaffrey. If anybody knows that about me, uh, he's my favorite NFL player. So, of course, I'm going to be a little biased thinking he's the MVP. But realistically, he's not going to win it just because running backs have never really won MVP. And I don't see that happening this year. Um, but his numbers are insane. He has uh, run the ball 141 times for 735 yards, and average, that's an average of 5.2 yards per carry. 
and he has eight touchdowns uh, on the ground. Um, I did not look up his receiving stats, but he has a couple hundred yards receiving and uh, I think two or three touchdowns with that. So he is even more um, through the air, and he's utilized more. Well, he utilizes everything now, but he used to be more of just a receiving back. So he really can do it all. Like He's insane. So he is close to 1,000 total yards this year, which is more than some teams. So that is just insane to me how, how he's so uh, he has so many plays that he has the ball in his hands. He I think he plays about 95% of the Panther snaps on offense. Could be a little low. It might be higher than that, actually. But it seems 4-3. and three. Not like it really matters. He's fourth in MVP voting. There's been running backs this high before at this point in the year, and they don't end up winning it just because a quarterback will end up winning it. But I really like McCaffrey. I would vote him. Actually, I would vote him for MVP as of right now over any of the quarterbacks. But will he keep it up the whole year? He could. I don't think he will keep up this pace because – this is only through seven games for him. He's had a bye already. So he hasn't even played eight games yet. I mean, he plays 16 games. He has nine more games to play. Uh, if he just repeated what he did the first half of the season, he would have close to, you know, 1,700, 1,600, 1,700 yards. That's insane. <laughs> 1,700 yards. He might have close to 20 total touchdowns. Uh, for a running back, that's insane. So uh, I don't think he'll keep it up, but if he did, I would give it to him. But I just don't think it's going to happen. I think it's going to go to a quarterback. So that's it for this video. Just wanted to let you all guys know on the updated MVP uh, voting, Aaron Rodgers has taken the lead after his game last week. Uh, so let me know what you all think about your MVP. Um, tell me who it is in the comments, and I will see you guys next time.